Hey guys, it's your girl Carmise. Welcome back to my channel. So today we are having Chipotle. I always get white rice or brown rice, chicken, the hot sauce, or mild, or I have both. Like in this room, I have both of them together. Um, cheese and lettuce. That's all I have in my burrito. I haven't put nothing else, nothing out of the ordinary. Cause I'm very basic and I'm a picky eater. I was craving Chipotle today. Just had to get it. The line was super long. Like I was up in that line for like 10 minutes. For real, for real. This is my burrito. Oh, it's lettuce for sure. Right now we got lettuce on one side and then the rice and the chicken on the other side. But you guys, I have a little story to tell y'all, okay? What I really want to talk to you guys about is something that happened to me over the weekend. Remember when I did that vlog when I went to ShopRite and then I did one of these mukbang? It happened that day when I filmed. So, I'm gonna say that I must have, when I pushed you guys into my pocket, my camera, my key probably must have fell. And it obviously did it because somebody had it. But I had my headphones on and I was listening to music. Like my music was blasting and I had a shop head bag in my hand that had my wallet inside the shop head bag. And usually my key is inside my wallet or in my pocket. But I remember when I went to ShopRite, I get the lady the ShopRite card. So when I get her when I get my key bag, I probably would just put it in my pocket. But I don't know how I fell out. But My door was locked. That means I probably was just walking in and it fell out. And I know because I had my music blasting in my ear. The next morning, I was going to go out and I couldn't find my keys. I literally cleaned out my room three times, four, <clears throat> four times. And I still couldn't find it. So I'm like, okay, I'm going to drop it outside. So I look outside out in the freezing cold looking back and forth, back and forth, back and forth calling the office over and over and over again asking if anybody has turned in my keys and they keep saying no they keep checking and they keep saying no so then my mom had no choice but to send me my spare key for temporary until I find my other key because it's not safe if both of us have I have a key and my sister has my key that's scary as fuck so she's about to send it she sent it monday morning and i called the office one more time and i asked hello did anybody turn in a lost car key and then she said yes i was like what she's like yeah she's like ultima i'm like yes ultima car key and then she was like can you describe it and i said it's a it's a remote and then I have a shop right card and then I have my house key and she's like yep yeah, I have it I'm like oh my god yeah. and I was like oh my god I've been looking for it since Friday and it was Monday so then I texted my mom and I was like mom you can um I think you can if you're not busy I think you can go back to the post office and get the package back and then get a refund because she paid like $25 for overnight shipping so I could get it Tuesday so I told her, maybe you could do that. She's like, oh, I don't know. I'm like, okay. And she was like, oh, I was able to. She's like, oh, good thinking. I'm like, yeah, I <laughs> know. <laughs> and yeah, she got her refund and I had my key. And things are good. But I just wonder why the person, like, kept my key for that long. You know? Did you think the office wasn't open on the weekends? Cause he literally waited until Monday, or she waited until Monday to turn in my key. My guess got best them for not doing anything. All my stuff is still here, so maybe they just thought that the office was closed on the weekends. So that's gonna be the only explanation for why they took that long to 
turning my key. Cause I've been calling the office every single day, asking, has anybody turned in and lost car keys? And they all keep saying no, every single day. So they literally took that long <clears throat> to send in my key. So, my estimation is that that she thought, or he thought that they are closed on the weekends. Office. But thank God that I have my key back. And everything is still here. It's still the same. Same parking spot. You know? I had this car for two years and never lost my key before, so. It's really tiny, so I think I should get. At first, I had like a fuzz ball, but it broke off, so I just been holding it like slim. It's like literally just three little things on it. So when I had my music blast, I couldn't see or hear it drop. So I'm trying to watch more Wiz Khalifa day to day. I love him so much. Look at my home. Oh, yeah, look at my home screen. Okay, so here's my lock screen. Now this is my home screen. My baby. <laughs> and then this is my full clothes. Okay, this is my home screen. No, my lock screen. So yeah, you can tell that I'm a big fan of what's Khalifa. Anyways, that's all that I have for you guys today. If you guys like this mukbang, don't forget to give this video a big thumbs up. Subscribe to the channel. Make sure you guys turn your post notifications soon for every single time your girl uploads her videos. And yeah, I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye. Kill a prank. I can't. I don't even know where to look at the camera. I still don't know where to look.